Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you how to install macOS Tar Hall Public Release 26 on um, VMware. So let's get started. So before we begin the macOS Tar Hall Public uh, 26 release install as always you will need the macOS Tahoe ISO file ISO file not the like DMG file so I put the link in the description so you guys make sure to check it and also I've already downloaded so I don't need to download it anyway also I'll put the link in the description and now the next thing is you need to have is VMware Workstation. So go to your tab, and then you just like type VMware download. You could visit this website or this website. But since I've already has got the VMware Workstation here, so I don't need to download it anymore. And the next thing is you need to have is locker tool. Visit this website. Now you're gonna click on this release here. And now you're gonna click on this. And now the next thing is before that I will show you before we patching the um before we patching the uh, Mac OS uh, locker tool click on create new virtual machine typical so now you're gonna choose your Mac OS Tahoe file So you can see here it didn't has got it didn't have got the Apple macOS like before of my video so we will patch it. Now you're gonna close VMware Station. Go to explore. Now here's my file. And now you just need to um, locate it, the Win install CMD, like the instruction said here. Now you can see there's a Win install CMD here. Now click on it, right click, and just run as an administrator. Alright, so we done. Now we're gonna open the apps again. Create a new virtual machine. Typical. Now you're gonna choose the Microsoft Hall ISO again. So this time you should see Apple Mac OS here. Now you're gonna choose the version is 15. Next. And at the location is, that is the where you install macOS Tahoe. So if you want to keep the default, you can keep or you can change it like me. So I will change it into my network storage. Click on browse network or if it's failed you can install it on the local disk so I would take my um, data for 
the um, install. And now for the installing disk, so you need at least 80 gigabyte for installation. Finish. And so before we run the <coughs> virtual machine, now locate it to your Mac OS Tahoe file again here. And now you're gonna choose, and now you're gonna find the VMX file for me. VMX file here. Right click, and now you're gonna choose Edit in Notepad. Scroll down till you scroll to the end of the notepad. Now you're gonna press Shift Enter, and now type this command like me. And now you're gonna click on File, Save. Now close this window. And now you're gonna click on Power on this virtual machine. And when you see the Apple logos, it means you're good. Alright, so when you see the screen, <coughs> now you're gonna choose the language is English. Now you're gonna choose this utility, continue. Now you're gonna choose VMware Virtual SATA Hard Drive My Idea here. Now you're gonna click on Erase. Now you're gonna name it to Mac OS or whatever the name you want. Now remember, format is APFS and stream is GUID. Erase. Now I'm gonna click on done. Close this window. Install Mac OS Tahoe. Continue. Click on continue. Agree. Now I'm gonna choose disk. Continue. Because I don't have the AMD RX graphics, so it just stuck right here. So if you guys has got the AMD RX graphics, you guys can continue. So if you like this video, then please subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to click on the like, sub, share button, and watch my new video. And I'll see you next video soon. Goodbye.